everyone and welcome back to our channel. We're Dos Cavazos and this is the finale of Castlevania Season 1. So, uh, where we left off, Trevor is running away from the members of the church, kind of going through the streets of Greshit. And it looks like, you know, Dracula's hell demon dogs are going to mm -hmm. be coming after him. I feel like he's going to be able to use that to his benefit, though. I feel like he could handle them. At least, I don't know if he can handle every single one of them, but I feel like, you know, they're not all going to attack him all at once, and he's going to probably have to deal with a few of them, but I feel like he's going to be able to use them as a distraction in order to get away. So Sypha and the rest of the speakers are in the tomb uh, where the Cyclops was, and they said that, like, oh, did you hear something move? I don't know why I have a feeling that they're going to, like, find something down there. That's also where they said was, like, uh, remnants of, I guess, like, the story. I forgot the exact wording, but basically, like, potentially Dracula's or something yeah, like which that. Which we did see electricity down there. Right. You know, in this first season, there wasn't a whole lot of Dracula, but kind of what I said in the last episode, it seems like he's just going to be like a presence in the background for a majority of the time, in my opinion, and I feel like he'll pop up in like kind of big moments. It's interesting that, like you said, this season's only four episodes. Right. Um, so I feel like, you know, it was really testing the waters to see like, you know, how well the show was going to do. And then I heard that the show actually picks up as it continues to go, which that's really exciting. All right, well, if you haven't already, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out our Patreon if you want to watch our full length reactions. We also do have a second channel called Dos Cavazos IRL where we do vlogs and other things like that. And if you want to check that out, the link's down below. All right, let's jump into this episode. Is it the hounds? Is it Dracula? Oh, well, the speaker's dead. I feel like it's Is Dracula. It Dracula? <gasps> well, get back out there. The speakers have to die before the sun goes down. The sun is already down. Wait, is this? It might just be the, I guess, they talk? Okay. Okay, well, the bishop might not be around for very long. <laughs> But this one looks different than the other ones. Let me kiss you. Ew. More like eat you. Yeah. Ugh. What? What is this ring of fire? Oh! Oh, they have, they like, have powers. powers, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I am a speaker and a scholar of magic. I serve no demon and I do no evil. Hey, well, good for you, Sypha. You never told me you were a magician. You never asked. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess I now understand why it was you who went down into the catacombs to look for your sleepy god. I didn't ask you to fight for me. I fight for myself. I feel like they're gonna have this thing. Who started it all by killing a defenseless woman? You would have made murderers out of these people. But the only one here who isn't innocent is you. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. I wasn't expecting that. Damn, he didn't even have to fight him. They got all oh my gosh. Pike, up front now. Why? Because I'm the only man here who knows how to fight these things. Six in front, six behind, and in between. Pike's forward. Shield wall. <laughs> Need a priest. One who was properly ordained in a church. Probably. Properly. Oh, properly. <laughs> <laughs> I said probably. I was like, oh. <laughs> Good enough. Yeah. What to do with water, yes? Bless it. Yes, Persian. Everyone with a sword wipes their blades in the salt. Wow, he's like prepared. Mm hmm. Did you learn this at like Belmont School? <laughs> Belmont School. It's like I learned this at, when I was three years old. Mm hmm. <laughs> You see the reflection? Oh, oh it burns on. Oh, guys. Four steps forward. Damn, he really organizes really quickly. <laughs> oh, it's got the big one in there too. Damn. Probably the first one that they've killed. Yeah. And they're like able to do it too. So salt is the key. Mm -hmm. Does pink Himalayan salt work? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see what the big one does or says. I feel like he's gonna be a lot tougher go. Yeah. Oh. Oh, maybe okay. not. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is it going back to the catacombs? Oh, maybe. I still feel like that's gonna be like a freaking big fall. Long fall, right? Mm hmm. Oh, magic, okay. yeah. Magic for the win. Mage. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, there's other safeguards here. Sam really just jumped right out that thing. You think he's doing it like Dracula? I don't 
don't know. Like, why is everything collapsing? How much deeper does this go? <laughs> okay. Is this his house? Is that what it looked like? Oh. Oh, that looks maybe like it's his tomb. Oh shit. I didn't do that. Another safeguard. Oh wait. Wait, it's was Legolas. this the other one? <laughs> <laughs> this is the sleeping one, maybe, that they were talking about. Yeah. Are you like a different kind of vampire? Like you're an energy vampire. The Messiah sleeps under Gracian, the man who will save us. Oh, so that's who they think. You're asking if I believe you're some sleeping Messiah who'll save us, and no, I don't. I know what you are. What are you? And what am I? You're a vampire. Okay. Tell her exactly how long you've been waiting down here. What is the year of your lord? 1476. That's a year then. I can't okay. tell, like... Like what his... His, his motivations right. are? Yeah, like... So he still thinks he could be Dracula? Yeah, I guess so. Because, like, I guess he wouldn't have never seen him, so... Mm -hmm. And he just assumes. Ugh. I still feel like this vampire wants to kill him. Like, you would think that this was the person who, like, appeared behind Dracula. Yeah. But maybe I'm just doing it because, you know, it was, like, light and I just see his blonde hair. Oh. <laughs> Please. This is <laughs> So why didn't that work? I mean, <laughs> the uh, uh, <laughs> undead balls, I guess. <laughs> wait, whose sword was that? Oh uh -oh. shit. Oh wait! Uh-oh. Do you have a god to put a last prayer to Belmont? Please don't let the vampire's gods ruin my good tunic. <laughs> what? He's gonna stab him. <gasps> oh, oh shit! Killing you was the point. Living through it was just a luxury. <laughs> I will incinerate you before your fangs touch that man's throat. A vampire hunter and a magician. You'll do. Just testing him. I am Adrian Depesh. Adrian. Mm -hmm. Known to the Wallachians as Alucard, son of Vlad, Dracula Tepesh. I've been asleep here what? in my private keep under Greshid for a year to heal the wounds dealt by my father. It's his it dad? It was! It's his son, yeah! Okay. So that was the wound he probably gave him when he tried right. to stop him. The sleeping soldier would be met by a hunter and a scholar. No one told me that. Why do you think my grandfather tried everything to make you stay? I hate speakers. So if it was been about a year, he came here right after like the whole incidents with Lisa. I need help to save Olekia. Perhaps the world. And defeat my father. Oh shit, okay. Uh, wow. Because it is one my mother would have wanted. He was like the son with him and Lisa? I guess so, yeah. How does that work out chronologically? I guess it had been a while, mm -hmm. right? Maybe vampires age different. Yeah. My father has to die. We three. He has her hair. Mm -hmm. We can destroy him. That's what okay. I kind of figured, but then I was like... Interesting. <laughs> That's cool. I didn't expect yeah. the story to go that way, but that yeah, makes me excited. I know. Now I'm excited, too. It's, it feel like this is all setting up, like, the real story, mm -hmm. you know? All right. So, Dracula's and Lisa's son. Mm -hmm. Alucard, I believe, mm -hmm. is what his name was. And I'm pretty excited about these possibilities now of Dracula's son teaming up with Sypha and with Trevor to take down Dracula. Yeah. That's pretty cool. So that's why he was here. That's who we saw. Mm -hmm. That's probably why he didn't kill him. Yeah. Like Dracula didn't kill his own son. But he had that like cut right across his chest him, and right. stuff like that. So he said he's been here about a year or so. So Way chronologically, exactly, yeah. it makes sense that he came here right after, you know, Dracula <laughs> lost Lisa and then he went all ballistic and then he told he gave them a year before he like showed up right. there and took out like everybody else mm -hmm. in that city. Yeah, like I said, it feels like that was this whole first season was really setting up like what the real main not that that wasn't the story, but you know, like mm. it feels like this is really like the story, you know, setting up the characters right. for the story. And yeah. now we're like, okay, we're going in it, and now it's gonna be like them three trying to get Dracula, which is really, really exciting, and I'm looking forward to it. I know, I'm really am too. We also found out that Sypha is also a magician and has these mystical, magical powers, but I also found out for myself that I ship her and Trevor. <laughs> you, you I feel like you ship more than I ship. I don't know. In Casey shows. ships a lot, and so in, sh in stows and shows. <laughs> Anyway, I ship him too. <laughs> yeah. Watch her end up getting with over here, Aldon or whatever his name is. Aldon, Aldon. 
Alder Alderon Alderon <laughs> like it's fucking Star Wars. Uh, What's his name again? Alucard. 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 Let's see. Hold on. We're like watching it real quick. Oh. Well, that's his. Adrian. But he goes by. Alucard. Alucard. No okay. to the yeah. So his name is Adrian, but yeah, we're gonna go with Adrian for I think now Adrian. because it's easier to remember for now. Yeah. But I'm sure as like you know it progresses and we hear it a lot more, it's gonna be easier to remember. Yeah. But Adrian for now. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell so you can stay notified for all of our future videos. Also, head over to our Patreon if you want to watch our full-length reaction to Castlevania. We upload them over there. The links down in the description below. Okay. We'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.